Did you guess Dilophosaurus? Hello? That was actually the call of a whooping swan. Dinosaurs shared many features with modern-day birds. For instance, we now know that many theropod dinosaurs from the Jurassic period's vocal organs are just like modern birds. We are arriving at the fourth of seven lookouts along the tour. Your Jurassic Park tour vehicle will stop for five minutes to let you stretch your legs and take photographs of our animals. Next stop, the Jurassic Park Marine Facility and Aquarium. Would you look at this? What are they? They look like feeder tanks. This could be a hatchery. A hatcher what? They're raising these fish to feed another animal. Like at Marine World. Like the killer whales? Precisely. Look, there's a sign over there. It looks like a schedule or something. This is a hatchery. That's the stocking schedule for the tanks. Some tells me these fish aren't for feeding whales, huh, Doc? Hold up. I hear something. All clear. Dad! Jess! Oh, thank God! Are you okay? Are you hurt? No! I I'm okay! Just... can we go home now? I'm so glad you two are safe, Jerry. How did you manage to get here? We climbed out of the tunnels through a service hatch near one of the tour routes. Luckily, someone left the tour program running. Thanks. You mean... Dr. Sorkin, the phones are not working. I'm sorry? There is no dial tone. You said the phones would be working here. That's odd. My control terminal showed that the main lines here were active. Unless... Of course. Everything is controlled by the computer systems, even the phones. If the power outage outlasted the battery backups, then the system is probably just waiting to be booted up. Get us to the phones, Doc. We don't have a lot of time. Mr. Yoder, I refuse to be pushed around by you any longer. Look, this isn't a day trip. If we don't contact InGen and get another helicopter out here for you all, the next flight over the island is going to be a wing of B-52s carrying holy hellfire! What?! That's right, Doc. We're going to murder all your precious little pets and sink this island into the Pacific! Dios mio! That's what you meant by Ground Zero? Yeah, that's right. Why didn't you tell me earlier? This is my home! <laughs> what do you mean, your home? I didn't tell you earlier because I thought we'd be off the island by now. This island is the ancestral home of her people. Wait, what is Dr. Sorkin doing? Laura? Wait, what are you? Where is she going? I don't know. This rotunda, it's where the control room is. She's going to the phones without us. Damn it, get that elevator back up here! Wow, they've really made a lot of progress in construction here. Paleozoic, huh? Well, most of the specimens here aren't really from the Jurassic period anyway. Ah, Paleozoic. From oldest to newest. Cambrian, Ordovician, Silurian, Devonian, Carboniferous, Permian. How are you holding up, Jess? I can't stop shaking. I'd literally rather be back in jail for shoplifting. I'm just so tired of running, Dad. I know, I know, me too. But we're safe for now.
Interesting concept. Living fossils. I guess you can't expect a mosquito to feed on fish swimming hundreds of meters under the sea. This little pool is cool. Were these creatures all cloned like the dinosaurs? No, these aren't actually extinct animals, Jess. They live in the oceans today. They're called living fossils because they haven't evolved much from the ancient fossil forms discovered by paleontologists. Oh, is that a horseshoe crab? Could be. To be honest, I don't really know all that much about sea fauna. <laughs> fauna. What is that supposed to be? I don't know. Looks like a mosasaur. Mosa what? It looks kind of scary. Well, it's sort of a, a sea lizard of sorts. You think of a um, big moray eel with a crocodile head. Croco eel? Great. Sounds charming. Don't worry. There are no sea creatures on my list of park animals. How did you two get here so fast? A tour vehicle picked us up. Great. Here I was running for my life in those tunnels, and you two are on a date. A date? Give me a break. Dad, I'm so sorry I caused all this trouble. Hey, hey, this isn't your fault. It is. With the smoking, the dinosaurs, the stealing, my grades, I, I don't mean to be such a screw-up all the time. Look, Jess, I know I can come down on you hard sometimes. I just, I feel like I have to cram months of being a dad into the few short days I get with you. But you're an amazing young woman. I'm proud of you, and I just, I don't want you to have to make the same mistakes I've made. Why do you have an aquarium here? Can you even clone an ancient fish? Not as far as I know. I don't know of any amphibious mosquitoes. Huh? Well, you remember how the tour explained that we get our dino DNA from fossilized mosquitoes, right? Mosquitoes can't exactly bite an animal that spends its life underwater. Oh yeah, good point. I'll be over by the info desk, okay? Yeah, Dad. <laughs> 